the fact that whenever you have a day's gainer that goes up like a bat out of hell in the morning, the price eventually decays, and that is an indicator that there are more sellers than buyers, and that pretty much proves it today. But really, what caused all this? Well, <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. Hold on just a second. We got a d <laughs> Shut up! That person probably uh, lost their ass in the stock market today. I don't blame them for being such a jerk nut. Uh, but anyway, uh, what really caused all this? Well, we said here last Thursday and Friday, it was the earnings of Intel. There's All right, with a B, he has $277 billion in cash I'd waiting. Buy that for a all dollar. right. And what is this? Ghost equals Dollar Tree Tucker Carlson. Shut up. All right. Tucker Carlson is a Russian simp. All right. I'm no Russian sip boy. <laughs> I'd buy that. And what the hell is this? Ghost is a capitalist. Ghost is a capitalist. A capitalist. Ghost is a capitalist. Ghost is a capitalist. Ghost, right. is, a capitalist. Right. Ghost is a capitalist. Ghost is a capitalist. Ghost right, is a capitalist. Ghost is a capitalist. Shut up! All right, we're in the midst of a bloody Monday here. All right, many of you are probably pissed off and are text speeching because the inner circle, the true capitalist radio membership, I mean, we're flying high, baby. This isn't affecting us at all. As a matter of fact, we've been waiting for this. We have a whole bunch of cash on hand. And right now, in my opinion, I think everybody should start looking at the small caps. It is a major buying opportunity as this market continues to go down. I ordered from NVIDIA. So that's another factor on why we're seeing this contraction in tech. I'd buy that for a dollar. Warren Buffet may be a Jew, but Berkshire Hathaway owns my company. They plan to give us a 10% bonus this end of the year. Oh, uh, look at Menno Ray over here, huh? Working for Berkshire Hathaway and calling his boss some kind of derogatory name. That's great, Menno Ray. All right? You better hope that damn Warren Buffett doesn't find out who you are, you dumb, stupid, fucking anti-Semitic piece of trash. And uh, urinator, do you like... I don't, I don't love you, you sick bastard. You're a gay sexual harasser, urinator. Anyway, once again, this is going to continue. Do not buy the dip, in my view... When it comes to these apples and the anything in tech, it's been overinflated for some time. It has gone too far, and as a result, the cut by the Fed is an attempt at trying to bring liquidity back into the markets because the liquidity is dried up, and we're all going to feel it. All right, we're all going to feel it. And uh, hold on, Devious Dave just said uh, Jimmy Carter just died. I'm not too sure. Hey, where the hell did I go? Where the hey? Where the hell did I go? There I am. Anyway, uh, it seems like Jimmy Carter cut down. I died. I, I don't know what the hell happened. Did Jimmy Carter die? I don't. I don't. I don't see that. Probably Wednesday. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know yet. All right, a lot of things going on out here. Buy that for a dollar. The pirate, um, right? We told you, safe investments be smart investments, and putting your doubloons in Long John Silver's chain of taverns long, as the market special. Long today John was Silver sucks. Move. The seas will always provide, and you and lovers need to realize that. Great. Thank you, Pirate Wright. Long John Silvers, give me a break. I can't believe they're even still around. All right, they fucking, what are they? Well, I don't even know what they serve as fish. I mean, don't they serve like the fucking Gorton's fishermen or some shit? I don't know. Anyway, we got another rumble rant from Tretchman. Uh, thinking of putting a grand in inverse ETFs and sitting on it a week or two. Thoughts? All right, in my opinion. Uh, we got Jacef. I'm flying high on this weed tobacco. I'm smoking, laughing my ass off. Ghost is a psyop. Buy the dip. Don't buy the dip. And Vox Art Official, me, Magic, Tom Soyo Albellini. What the fuck is that shit? Hold on, folks. My apology. What the fuck is this shit? What the hell is this crap? Hold on. Put the PC shot on. Look at this shit. What, what is this? Tom... Tommaso Albellini was an Italian composer of the bro, uh, Baroque era. All right, we get it, asshole. All right. Thanks all. Real funny. And then we got Tesla Cyberheart telling everybody to buy the double dip, which I don't appreciate either. All right. But anyway, folks, once again, after all is said and done, I don't suggest anybody buy any of these dipped stocks that are the, uh, the big 12 or these overinflated tech stocks. Everybody who's a hedge fund manager, a mutual fund, a retirement fund manager. <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. What the hell? Yeah, Jimmy Carter was sent down to Davy Jones's locker. What? Yo ho ho and a bottle of Estradiol flavored Stella Artois. Davy Jones's locker? What the fuck does that mean? 
Anyway, as I stated, a great rotation is about to happen. Now, many of these fund managers are going to sell off from many of these over-speculated tech stocks. I think it's a decent long-term investment. I did not like the insider sell-off by, I believe, either one of the corporate executives of Rumble. So that got me kind of apprehensive. Ghost will talk negative about Trump. You will see him reference a lot of articles. Take note that he will analyze Kamala far less than what What are you talking Trump. about? I just shit talk this he bitch. Lines in the spectrum. Liberal -er. Hey, asshole. I just talk shit about this broad. All right? I do not like Kamala Harris. But because she's probably going to keep the status quo of the current foreign policy, that's why I would prefer this side over the other side because I want the Republicans to lose. I want all the MAGA Republicans to lose. I want the Freedom Caucus to lose. I want the, the, the current politic of the right wing to lose. In order for the GOP to be in shambles in 2025, and those of us that still have conservatism, that still have some semblance of conservatism, can come in and take over the party. All right? That's all there is to it. We have to eliminate the faction that's within the Republican Party that has infected the Republican Party, that has made the Republican Party lose their values, lose what they uh, used to fight for back in the old days of Republican conservatism. We need to bring it back. We need to be re re we need to bring it back. And in my opinion, I would prefer to see the Democrats win across the board. So that the sting of whatever the fuck policies that they throw down our throats hurts so bad that the Republicans will never lose their values again. Shut up, you stupid moron. And uh, trolling the interwebs with a $5 rumble rant, uh, Trump is clearly throwing his campaign away. There's no way anyone could make all the wrong moves like this by accident. And you know what, trolling? I agree. I, it's either he's incompetent, which I don't think that he is, or he's doing this on purpose. <laughs> I, I have no idea. <laughs> All right, I have no idea. All right, and uh, what's going on? A uh, Vox artificial. So you're voting blue down the ballot? I'm not voting. You dumb shit. I'm promoting that the Republicans should lose. I'm not voting. All right. You know what I'm doing? Voting day. I'm going to the bar. That's what I'm doing. All right. I'm going to the bar because nobody's going to be there. I'm going to get me some fucking wings. I'm going to get me some 29-degree draft beer served in an ice-cold 32-ounce mug. And I'm going to have it served to me by some 24-year-old bimbo that's scandally clad where there's fucking some sports on the fucking screen there, all right? And uh, what is it? Oh, feminist socialist, a paid Democrat shill. Fuck off. Urinator, those of us who still have conservatism hope they're uh, the party for trans kids and aborting babies wins. Hey, listen. Uh, unlike your shitty-ass pussy-whip state urinator, all right, we banned that shit over here. As a matter of fact, Texas, the next thing on the uh, Texas legislature is banning any kind of transitioning medication or surgery for children. All right? So while you people are out there talking a bunch of shit, I'm talking, yeah, I hate trans kids. Yeah, I hate this. I hate the drag queens. I, 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 I read in the kindergartners. I, I, I don't like this. We're out here doing it, asshole. All right, out here in Texas, we're doing it on a state level. All right, while you people are out there talking and talking about how you hate this and how you hate that, none of you people are running for anything. None of you people are backing up any politician that's going to make such a policy into law. None of you are doing shit. All you people are doing are flapping your fat Cheeto-stained fingers on the keyboard talking a bunch of shit. All right? So go fuck off. Jesus Christ. And you see, every one of you people that are talking garbage, the reason you're talking garbage is because you know I'm telling the truth. All right? Every one of you that are, oh, yeah, you know, I don't like the trans kids. Oh, yeah, I don't like the you know, drag queens reading the five-year-olds. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like that. We've already banned that shit in Texas, boy. We've already banned that shit in Texas. You can't even access pornographic material online in Texas, boy. You can't get an abortion past six weeks in Texas, boy. We made it illegal. I buy that for a what? Fat bitch. 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 
I've got your bitch! And what is this, urinator? Those of us who still have... Oh, shut up, urinator. I read your stupid fucking rumble rant. And Vox Artificials, uh, my... Actually, my fingers are Miss Vicky stained. What the hell is that? What the hell is salt and vinegar, to be precise? <laughs> great. I'd buy that for a dollar. Klansman for karma. Oh, that's great. All right, that, that's, that's just fucking great. Jesus Christ. You see, I'm over here. I'm trying to... I, I, you know, I'm trying to shoot pearls to you people out here. I'm trying to shoot some pearls to you people, and what the fuck are you doing? You ain't doing shit! Jesus Christ. I'm sorry, folks. All right? Uh, anyway, let's continue before we get trolled to any text-to-speech or any of that crap, please. All right? Put the PC shot on. Take a look at this, all right? Now, all you MAGA people, Trump's team had a Harris strategy. Then he went off the script about a race. And you see, this is my big issue right now in the 2024 cycle, is foreign policy. We're sticking it down the fucking Russians and Chinese and North Koreans and Iranians' throats. All right? And the last thing we need is this fucking guy to make us look like a bunch of chumps and bow down to these fucking people. Fuck that shit. All right? Fuck that shit. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Breaking news. Several U.S. personnel injured in Iran-backed missile attack in Iraq. I love Biden-Harris foreign policy, by the way. <laughs> it's it's the price of war. All right? And go supports the... Yeah, shut up, asshole. Now, listen, didn't I tell you that we were going to get involved in this Iranian offensive when it happens and we we're going to use our troops in Iraq? This right here gives us the justification for it, if true. All right? Uh, but uh, listen, Vox Art Official said crazy things going on in Japan right now and left me a link. So let me, this better be fucking pertinent there, Vox. I'm not, I'm not joking around. And what is this? Um, what, what the fuck is it? Put the PC shot on. Uh, several Japanese zoos participated in a copybara watermelon eating competition. This competition was won by Hachima. A capybara representing the Satamiya Children's Zoo. Hekamiya finished 500 grams of watermelon in under a minute and 48. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking shitting me? What? Michael Scott works at 17 2 and 5 slow. No, no, take that off. It's a fucking dox. Kremlin bulletin, dude, fuck you, whoever the hell did that, man. I don't know how the fuck you did that, but cut the shit. Cut the shit. Cut the crap. A fucking copy bar of watermelon eating contest? Right. Fucking weirdos. But hey, I like capybaras, right? Capybaras, uh, they're the most chill animal, aren't they? They're like the most chill animal or something. Every animal likes them or some shit. I mean, it's, 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 you know, anyway. Thank you for that there, Vox. And what's going on to Duke Orbill with a $5 rumble rant? And he said, happy Black Monday, sir. I am bargain shopping. You better be bargain shopping those small caps there, Duke Orbill. This wouldn't have happened if we actually had a leader who had the balls to stand up to Iran. But you're over here sucking the schlong head of Iran and Blinken even though you're accusing Trump of doing that to Putin. What are you talking about, man? Iran's about to be uh, a fucking history. They're about to be in the history books once they make this move. And you notice they keep threatening that they're going to make a move, but they don't want to make a move, don't they? Anyway, I don't want to get ahead of myself. Anyway, cheers to Duke Orville. Like I said, man, be taking a look at some of these growth micro and small cap stocks right now. I mean, we should see them start taking off here in the next year. And uh, that's what me and the inner circle are doing. That's what, uh, you know, I, I suggested to the True Capitalist Radio membership to do. And that's what we're doing, baby. I'd buy that for a dollar. Type B2 to kick ghosts balls for hating LGS or LJS. What the fuck is LJS? Anyway, let's continue. All right. Uh, you know, even though Trump tried to go racial... His camp realizes that, look, we got to counteract this. So what did they do? They brought in their blacks. 
All right. I'd buy that for a dollar. Why are so few reported? Because goats can't talk. Oh, Jesus. Fucking Kirk Johnson. Enough of that shit, all right? Anyway, uh, Trump brought out some woman that they're now calling her an activist, even though he only met her at a Chick-fil-A. I guess he was serving. She was serving his Chick-fil-A chicken sandwich or something. You have degraded the Republican Party into a sinful, disgusting fucking version of itself. I, I just, it's disgusting. I'd buy that for And what is it, the pirate right? Yeah, me heart is... Can you fuck off? Drink up, Jesus Christ, shut up! And Vox Artificials, type V if you want me instead of the rhinos. Okay, great. Urinator, type C if you slap ghosts with your schlong. Yeah, that's great, asshole, all right? But hey, I'm the bad guy, right? Yet, you guys are trying to hold water and are trying to be like, Hey, man, you know, you know, MAGA, dude, you're not understanding, man. MAGA, <laughs> MAGA, I'd man. That for a what? War has changed, Don. It's no longer about nations, ideologies, or ethnicity. It's an endless series of proxy battles fought by Rajesh and Sanjay. India and its consumption of curry has become a well oiled oh, machine. War has Can changed. You shut up. Sustained scammers. Shut up! All right, unless you're going to say something like a question or you're going to make a comment that's pertinent to the show, don't fucking text a speech, you fucking troll piece of shit. Jesus fucking Christ. Anyway, what? Ah, oh, fuck buy you. That for a fuck you. For our favorite director, William J. Vernes Milko. No, he talks in the CIA. No, who the fuck? What the fuck is your problem? They just talks the CIA director for fuck's sake, man. Are you out of your fucking mind? What the fuck? What the fuck? Dude, whoever did that, man, I hope there's a federal authority watching over you, you piece of crap, all right? I had nothing to do with that, all right? I had nothing to do with that. Jesus fucking Christ. All right, anyway, as I was stating before I got rudely interrupted by a bunch of text-to-speech jerk nuts, all right, while you people out there in Magaland are coping and are trying to hold water for Trump and all his hypocrisy and all his contradictions, you're doing the same thing to this fucking weirdo, his vice presidential pick, J.D. Vance. And I'd like for some of you to justify this. Jesus Christ, what a fucking weirdo. You know what I mean? What a fucking weirdo. And of course, you right-wingers over there, you're going to justify this by, well, you know what, Ghost? That's what men do now. That's what men do. You, Ghost, I really need to take a shit, but I kind of don't want to. I'm not on the poo retention flex. What But I am sort of unwilling to have to stop what I'm doing now. Don't worry, it's not jerking off. I am just busy viewing websites and stuff. Any thoughts? What are you fucking talking about, you sick piece of crap? I don't give a shit if you're going to take a shit. Jesus Christ, what are you, sticks, hex on hammer? And uh, feminist socialist with a rumble rant. Chill, guys, that's Ghost Boss. Fuck you. The space trains, test rant. Happy Monday, Ghost moving from Trump to what's the extent of the damage Iran's going to do to Israel. Do you think Israel will false flag themselves to kick off World War III? I wouldn't put it past Israel for, you know, inducing what would be interpreted as an Iranian attack in order to fucking take out Iran. That's why Iran ain't making a move. I don't want to get ahead of myself, all right, but that's why he ain't making a move. And Vox Artificial with a rumble rant, can't believe you doxed your boss. Fuck you, asshole, all right? Anyway, as I was stating, this is the vice presidential candidate. I mean, why are you wearing fucking eyeliner? Why are you wearing eyeliner? This looks like one of these drag queens that, you know, have the Fu Manchu. And that's the sad part about it. That's the kind of shit leftists do. That's the kind of shit leftists did during the 2008 Obama campaign. So give me a fucking break. All right, give me a damn break. And uh, hold on, a five-finger prostate. Oh, I'd Jesus. Buy that for a dollar. This is the fake Ghost, jag. I really need to use the bathroom. Can you pause the show for me? This is a fake jag deluxe ray, by the way, all right? And a five-finger prostate punch with a rumble rant. I'm taking a shit right now and can get paid big bucks. I might make it a half-hour poo. 
So you're one of those guys, you know, that, that you know, I, I, as an employer, I'm supposed to pay you to take a shit? You'd be fired in my book, boy. You understand? You take your shit on your own time, all right? And if you're still on the clock, well, then you clench your cheeks and hold your ass. Son of a bitch. Uh, trolley bastard pirate right is better than whatever baguette shit ghost is advocating right now. Well, you sound a little salty there, trolley bastard. You sound a little salty there, boy. Kamala Harris address. No, no, no take that shit off. Vicente take Bola. that fucking shit off. Don't be toxic candidates now, you fucking piece of shit. Stop. Just cut the shit. Cut the fucking shit. Cut the goddamn fucking shit. Jesus Christ, man. All right, you know what? Let me take this off. I'm sorry, folks. All right. Let me get to some of these uh, buy me a coffees here and see if they showed up. All right, they finally showed up. All right. Put the PC shot on. We got J Savs. I want the Republican Party to lose. He's going to call this shit AI splice in six months. No, I'm not. I want the Republicans to lose in 2024. So when the party is completely in shambles, those of us conservatives can take control of the party. What the fuck? No! no! You're, what are you fucking... You're doxing admirals now? What the fuck? Who the fuck is doing this shit, dude? You're gonna get me into some fucking trouble if y'all fucking keep doing this crap, dude. Y'all are gonna get me into some fucking trouble. Cut the crap! And urinator, would you bend me over... Oh, I'm not gonna say that, urinator. All right, I'm not saying that. You're a sick, gay, homosexual. And five-finger prostate punch, check your ex. I sent you a poo pic. I don't want to see your fucking feces, you sick son of a bitch. You see, people are sending me their fucking feces, for Christ's for sake. Trolling the interwebs with a rumble rant. Uh, really excited for this tour of political homes you're planning. I don't know what the hell that's supposed to mean, man, but thank you very much. And then we got Mega Max over here. Huh? You needed some fucking adulation? I'd buy that for a dollar. What the hell is this? Bill Maher works at 78. Bill Maher! Boulevard, Take it off, man! Stop doxing! For a God damn it! Stop doxing! Stop fucking doxing, people, man! Y'all are gonna get me in fucking trouble, man! Cut the shit! Jesus fucking Christ, man! Anyway, look, I'm sorry, folks. Let, let me get back to the show here, all right? Let me get back to the show. Uh, we're going to talk about well, my final thing about Harris, all right? Now, apparently, Harris is expected to announce her vice presidential pick tomorrow. Even though I thought it was today for some reason. Now it's tomorrow ahead of the Philadelphia rally. For a dollar. What the hell is this? Justin Trudeau lives at... Justin Trudeau! No, no, take that Ontario, shit up! Stop doxing fucking world leaders and famous people and shit, dude. Seriously. This is not funny. Don't laugh. You fuckers in the chat room, don't laugh at this fucking jerk. You're only gonna fucking make him want to do it even more, dude. Don't fucking laugh. Don't fucking laugh at this shit. Jesus Christ. Anyway, as I was stating before I got rudely interrupted, Harris is expected to make her vice presidential pick Tuesday, and it looks like it comes down to two. What exactly? Uh, Jatario. Hey, Mega Max, they're growing cotton outside my house just in case you needed some work. Uh, it's in your field of work. Oh, uh, I, I don't condone what Jatario just said. All right, I don't condone that. I do not condone that. Five finger prostate punch. Don't you hate when your dick touches the front of the bowl while taking a crap? You're a sick fucking asshole, dude. I mean, just don't donate to me if you're going to be fucking saying sick shit like that. All right? Just don't donate to me. Oh, okay. What? Well, no, it's Donald Trump's fucking docs. Donald John Trump home. Get it out now! Just listen, stop the shit! Stop doing the doxing and shit! Stop doing the fucked up fucking shit, man! Dude, this is not funny, dude. You fucking people in the chat room are egging this idiot on. You know that? You're egging this fucking asshole on. Cut the shit! Cut the shit! You're egging this asshole on! Jeez. Oh, no. Buy that for a what now? Kim Jong Un. DPRK Kim Jong Un lives in Kim Mall Dong No. Dot One Beep. Kim Jong Un. District Pyongyang. DPRK Kim Jong Un lives in Kim Mall Dong No. Dot One Beep. Street Moran Bong. District Pyongyang. DPRK Kim Jong Un. Thank you, Menoray. All right. 
And uh, we got Devious Dave. Does anyone know John McCain's address? I want to buy him some peanuts. That's He's dead, dude. All right? He's fucking dead. Anyway, let's... Uh, oh, Jesus Christ, man! Yeah. Bruce Ismay can be found at Stark at NSW 153DZ. What? Nivel Cemetery and Crematorium, London, United Kingdom, plus 44, 20. What the fuck are you? You're, you're doxing somebody's grave? Jesus Christ. Trolling the interwebs with a rumble rant. Capitalist army assemble at San Antonio Popeyes. We have marching orders. That's not funny. All right, trolling. That's not funny. That was a serious time that happened in the show, and I don't want to relive that, all right? I don't want to relive that shit. Anyway, let's make a transition, no pun intended, into some international stuff. <laughs> I'd buy that for a Cash dollar. man. Gas what is man. your opinion on us going into Venezuela? I say we strike now and take that oil. We could make illegals become our ground forces for a free U.S. citizenship. That's a very we good point. We should grease our Abrams tank threads with commie guts. That's actually a very good I suggestion there, gas dollar. man. No bullshit. For our favorite VP John Shapiro, five no, no, don't, don't talk. God damn it, no! Don't talk shit. Don't take it off. God damn it! Oh, 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 look, I'm gonna end this fucking show if you fucking idiots continue to do this dark shit. All right, I'm gonna end this fucking show if you people keep doing this doxing shit. Jesus Christ, man. Cut the crap or I'm ending this shit early, dude. All right? I'm not fucking joking around. Now, let's make a transition, no pun intended, and let's talk a little bit about the, uh, let's talk a little bit about some international news. All right? Hold on. Let me, let me fix this fucking chat room again. I'm telling you, this fucking Discord overlay sucks a cock with it. You know that? This Discord overlay sucks a fucking cock with it. So let me try to do this again, all right? All right, let me try to do this. All right, and then we're going to get to the international stuff. My apologies, folks. Don't say boomer versus technology. This ain't my fault, asshole. All right, this ain't my fucking fault, you fucking piece of shit. So all you people that are talking shit in the chat room, shut your goddamn mouth. And I'm talking the fucking other chat rooms, like the Vaughn and the Rumble and the Kick and the YouTube. Anyway, let's go ahead and transition. Now, before we start talking about any nation states, something very interesting <laughs> came about here. <laughs> hey, what's going to Kits Does a Flip? Hey, man, I'll read yours in just a second. By the way, very good addition to the inner circle. Cheers to Kits Does a Flip. Uh, put the PC shot on. The WHO chief, all right, the World Health Organization chief, moles calling an emergency committee on monkeypox. Oh, oh. Didn't I tell you that monkeypox was going to be the next pandemic? And for all those that didn't listen to that episode, it's on Ghost.Report. It's called Discourse on Virus <laughs> Patents, where I predicted this shit. Xi Jinping, he lives in intersection of Chongqing South Road, Xiaoqing, Agua West Road, Zhangjiang, Taipei 11, Jinping.com, Xi Jinping. He lives in intersection of Chongqing South Road, right, and right, Agua good, West Road. Uh, shut Zhangjiang, up! Shut Taipei up! 11 Jinping at ccp.com. And that's his address. That's his email. <laughs> I'd buy that I can for email a Xi Jinping. Iran attacks tonight around midnight CDT time. No, it's a got a dog. Take that shit off. That's a, a fucking dog. Shut it up. Super Mario Logan. Who the fuck is Super Mario Logan, Mega Max? All right. Hey, by the way, not per not your personal army, you fucking peanut. <laughs> Buy that for a dollar. Oh, fuck you. Yo. Rock apes that. You fucking motherfucker. You know, I'm going to end this show, dude. All right, I'm going to take the shit off. Take this shit off. Let me tell you something. Rock ape was an inner circle member that died of cancer. All right? And for you people to go there and hit below the belt, you people are fucking sick, macabre assholes. You're sick, macabre assholes. I'm telling you, I'm going to end this fucking show. I deserve more respect than, than what the fuck you people are giving me right now. All right? I've got a whole bunch of other shit to talk about, for Christ's sake. All right? I don't need you people hidden below the belt. I'd buy that for a dollar. The hell is this? For our favorite Rumble CEO. No, no, take that shit up. Fucking the Rumble CEO. Now, stop. Everybody stop. Just stop the doxing. Stop. 
Everybody stop! Cut the shit! Cut the shit! Oh my god, dude, you fucking people are fucked up, man. You know that? You people are fucked up. And Duke Orville with a $5 rumble rant. Hey, Ghost, fuck these trolls. You're goddamn right, Duke Orville. These fucking people, man, they're the scum. All right, they're the scum at the bottom of the fucking floor and the fucking gutter, man. All right, they make me fucking sick. That's why these people are being replaced, and that's why all they can do is piss and moan about it and flap their fat sausages of fingers on the keyboard because they ain't going to do a goddamn thing. All right? You motherfuckers ain't going to do a goddamn thing. Stupid son of a bitch. All right, you know what? I, I, you know, I'm doing me right now. All right, I'm doing me. I, I'm, 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 all, I'm almost at my wit's end with this show, so I'm going to do me right now, all right? Where's my pipe? Where's my pipe? All right, I'm smoking tobacco. All right, I'll get back to the international news here in just a second, folks. My apologies. All right. I just want to do, I'm just doing me here. All right. And you know, I got to do something. You know, it's, what is it, 522 here at the Ghost Show, or excuse me, the True Capitalist Radio Studios. Fucking ghost show. I'm not going to do a fucking ghost show for you fucking people. Are you kidding me? Look at how you're treating this serious show. This is a serious fucking show. <sighs> Jesus Christ, man. I'm a fucking, every time I come up here, man. I mean, why can't you people just go away, dude? Why can't you trolls just go fuck off? Get out of here. All right? I don't want you fuckers here, man. I want serious people. I want people that are going to take shit serious. Not a bunch of troll jerk off assholes who think that life is a fucking joke. Jesus fucking Christ. Get out. If you're a troll, get the fuck out of here right now. All right? If you're a fucking troll bastard, then get the fuck out of here. I don't want you here. You're fucking scumbags. You're a sphincter fingering, rose butted asshole having, used condom sucking piece of shit is what you are. Fucking son of a bitch. I deserve more respect in this crap. I can tell you that right goddamn now. You people are doxing shit on TTS. You're talking shit to me on fucking buy me a coffee and shit. Fuck all of you people. Seriously, go fuck all of you, dude. I don't give a fuck. All right? I deserve more respect in this fucking bullshit that you fucking people are giving. Shut up! In the fucking chat room, shut your fucking mouth! Shut your fucking mouth! Son of a bitch, let me have a fucking smoke so I can calm my ass down, all right? Jesus Christ. <coughs> That's it. <coughs> Gotta hold it in, let it hit the ring. <laughs> I'd buy that for a What dollar. the hell? For our favorite ex-owner Elon Musk. No, no, take that shit up. Yeah, no, don't fucking dox Elon Musk, you fucking bitch. What are you doing? <laughs> I'd buy that for oh, a Oh, God. Can, no. Ivan Enzo lives in Netherlands. No, 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 shut up. Shut up, man. Everybody shut the fuck up. Shut up. Oh I'd my buy god. That for a dollar. Hey, what's up to Cypher who just became a member? And by the way, let me go ahead and, and give everybody props out here. Cheers to Cypher. As a matter of fact, I may end this show early. Uh, put the PC shot on. If you want to become a true capitalist radio member uh, and get the exclusive 411 from Ghost himself, I'm going to be in the chat room after this show. I'm probably going to need a 30 minute break to get a smoke. <laughs> Buy that what the no, Benjamin Netanyahu! Take it out now! No! Cut the crap! Benjamin Netanyahu! Oh my God! Oh Jesus Christ, man! Anyway, as I was stating before, I got rudely interrupted by a bunch of fucking doxes. If you'd like to join the True Capitalist Radio member chat, it's right here, okay? And it's pure, serious conversation. Serious conversation about financial stuff, about domestic politics, about international relations. Ask anybody who's a member of this chat community. They will tell you that it is second to none. 
All right? There's no internet drama. There's none of that shit. We're not doing none of that shit. Calm down, have some dip, and do radio graffiti. Oh, Froppy, come on, man. You think that I, I'm going to do radio graffiti after these fucking scumbags have fucking ruined my goddamn show? Are you fucking nuts? Are you high? And Mega Max, we are here on TCR because you are a crybaby tard and easy to mess with. Yeah, fuck you, Mega Max. All right, you're supposed to be one of my blacks. All right? You're supposed to be one of my blacks. What the hell happened to you, man? Are you out of your cotton picking mind? Jesus Christ. Anyway, let me continue here once again. Um, I want to say cheers to Cypher, who became a member of the True Capitalist radio chat room. Cheers to you. And uh, Mega Max, uh, he docks somebody named Super Mario Logan, which we're not going to acknowledge there, boy. And we've got Kitsch does a flip. Hey, Ghost, I'm going to Maryland later on this month. John McCain is buried in Maryland. Should I give him a bag of peanuts? for a dollar. Mark Vaughn 400. No! Malibu no, Canyon take that Yard. shit off! Don't dox Mark Vaughn! What, what, what's your fucking name? Hitting babies with a rusty shovel? That's your fucking name? You sick fuck? That's your fucking name? Oh my god. I'm sorry, dude. I, I, I don't know what the hell to do, man. I'm not even joking. I don't even know what the fuck to do anymore. Anyway, we got OSHA who hooked it up. We got to actually have to go through a couple of these. Froppy said Trump campaign is a single state. <laughs> mean I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh, Jesus Christ. Stephen King lives. Ah! Fucking Stephen fucking King. What is your problem, man? What is wrong with you fucking people? What the fuck is wrong with you fucking people? Anyway, this fucking thing came back here. Here it is. Froppy Trump campaign in a single state. Meanwhile, Kamala is going all over the United States right now. Uh, J.D. Vance managed to take away all the attention from Trump's shooting by being the biggest embarrassment of a VP next to Sarah Palin. So I'm not too worried. I have my own opinions on Bisher and Shapiro, but either way, I doubt they will, uh, they'll sink it. Uh, what was it again? 16 points? How do you get negative points, Vance? I know. You know what, Froppy? I don't get it. Worst vice presidential pick in history. Bottom line. And Mega Max, uh, you're the one who's talking shit. Now get in the back of the... <laughs> Look at this guy. Fucking Mega Max, one of my blacks telling me to Rosa Parks myself. You Fuck you, asshole, all right? We got OSHA. Could you repeat that part about not letting your employees use the restroom on the clock? Yeah, uh, let me tell you something right now. If you're in my employee and you're shitting on my dime, um, you're fired, all right? You better fucking you, hold your ass, all right? That's all I got to say. And we've got Mad Dad, don't worry. After Trump leaves, we all have, we, we all are leaving and you'll have nobody left in your dying Christian-based party. We'll, we'll all leave your party and form the enemy Reich. Waifu for one, waifu for all, hail enemy. You see this? You see this, for Christ's sake? Jesus Christ. And cheers to Kitts. Uh, cheers to your trip to Maryland. Fuck you, Mega Max. And uh, Cypher in the house, ready to make some serious moves with these markets. It's a perfect time. We're always talking markets in the True Capitalist Radio member chat. And thank you for becoming a member there, Cypher. If you want to chill with me, Cypher, after this show, I will be in the chat room. Uh, give me about 30 minutes or so, because i got to fucking chill, have a smoke or something. And we got Froppy, calm down, have some dip, and radio graffiti. All right. Anyway, let's get to some international news now, all right? Now, obviously, everybody is waiting for Iran to make a move. We've been waiting all weekend. Take a look at this. Israel braces for Iranian attack that could come within hours as Hezbollah missile barrage injured two IDF soldiers. Uh, <laughs> I'd buy that. Lord Jimmy dollar. Burrito. Kamala's parents live at. No, no, home. take that shit off! Bing, God bing, damn it! Bing, 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 oh bing, bing, my bing, God! Bing, 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 bing. Whoa, that's a lot of personal info out there in the open, eh? Hey, Anonymous, that ain't me, all right? No, don't try to attribute any of this shit to me. It ain't me. It's these fucking jerk nuts out here that think they're so cute by doxing a bunch of fucking people, all right? I'd buy that. We don't condone... Oh, no. For our favorite Albertan Vox artificials... 
Dog started. Yeah, no, no, no. Baby punchers against enemy. What the fuck kind of name is that? Baby punchers against enemy. Dude, yeah, yeah, yeah dude. Uh, y'all are taking this way too far, dude. All right. Y'all, dude, y'all are at, yeah, this is fucked up shit. I'd buy that for a dollar. This is fucked up fucking shit, man. D dude, stop. Play. Everybody stop. Everybody just stop. And trolling the interwebs or the rumble rant that said, adding this show to my bookmarks for reasons. I look, I don't condone what the hell's going on here. That's all I got to say. All right. I absolutely do not condone what the hell's going on here. But anyway, as I was stating before I got rudely interrupted by some jerk off, Israel is bracing for Iranian attack. Apparently, it's going to be tonight around midnight ish. All right. I don't know why they're timing this. Uh, but then again, uh, we've been waiting, and Iran's been threatening, and Iran's been saying that all this and all that. Didn't I say that we were going to use our troops to aid any potential ground invasion f with the Israelis from our troops in Iraq? Huh? I'd buy that for a dollar. Join me for a bang-up service at Temple Bethel. No, no, it. no, fuck it. That's fucked up, dude. That is fucked up. Ted Kaczynski and you're doxing a fucking goddamn Jewish temple. That's fucking shit. You're a fucking scumbag. You're a fucking scumbag. Anyway, as I was stating, put the PC shot on, the U.S. to send more warships, fighter jets to the Middle East to bolster defenses. All right? Because what's going to happen is we're going to bomb, 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 bomb Iran. Once they make a move, once Iran makes a move, we're going to bomb, 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 bomb Iran. And fucking Israeli and U.S. ground troops are going to go right into Iran, and they're going to greet us as liberators, and that's it for the Ayatollah. That's it for that scumbag Islamic Republic regime. It's gone. All right, it'll be gone. That's what we're, that's what we're waiting for. All right, that's what we're waiting for. And Vox Artificials, why did you dox me, Ghost? I thought I was your top guy. I don't know who the fuck that was, Vox. I don't know who the fuck that was. And trolling the interweb said, first Michael Scott, now Vox Artificials? Have you no shame? Hashtag don't dox the Vox. I didn't do anything. It wasn't my fucking... It's some fucking asshole troll out there. That's why I'm telling you, don't encourage this prick by laughing. All right? Don't encourage this prick by laughing. Jesus Christ. Do you see what I have to fucking put up with here? But once again, U.S. to send warships, fighters. Oh, I'd Jesus. Buy that for a dollar. Also, hello, it's actually me, R. Damon. I can actually use donation alerts again. I was the last anonymous that was 10 bucks. Huh. I guess Scuff Nation alerts fix itself. Oh, come on, Art Hammond. All right, come on, Art Hammond. Uh, but anyway, we're ready. Israel's ready. And it's go time. Once Iran decides to send its first missile. All right, it's on. Probably UK, probably some of the EU <laughs> member buy states. That for a dollar. Donald Trump lives at 11. No, 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 cut the shit. Jesus fucking, just cut the crap. Anyway, as I was stating, what kind of a coalition you're asking? Well, take a look at two Arab nations, all right, that are coming out to the defense. Take a look at this. Jordan, Saudi Arabia, tell Iran it must stay out of airspace if it attacks Israel. So it can't use its airspace in order to attack Israel. So this is going to be a very interesting situation. This is why Iran is not making a move. They know that if they make a move, it could be the end of the Islamic Republic. It, it could be the absolute end, and they know it. The Ayatollah knows it. The president knows it. I mean, hell, after somebody that they hosted, the leader of Hamas, gets assassinated in Tehran right underneath their noses, come on, Maine. Come on, Maine. And by the way... Iran is finally coming out, and they're saying, look, all right, we really don't want an, a, a regional escalation. Take a look at this. Iran says it doesn't want a regional ex escalation, but it, quote, 
must punish Israel. So now we know why Iran was sitting on its thumbs. It's trying to figure out a way to make it look like it's going to spank Israel without provoking Israel so bad that it could be the end of the Islamic Republic. It could be the end of the Islamic So, oh, oh. Yeah, that's why they haven't done a goddamn thing, because they don't know how to spank Israel. They don't know how to do it. They don't know how to do it. They know if they push too hard, that could be the end of them. And if they don't push enough, all these Islamic folks that are, you know, wanting some kind of retribution for this Hamas leader getting assassinated, they're going to be pissed off. So anyway, cat cans with the $5 rumble rant. SPY up a percent after hours. We're so back. Yeah, no shit. Here we go again. Hey, I'm going to buy the step. I'm going to buy the step. Don't buy the dip. Don't buy the dip. But anyway, we'll see what happens tonight. If Iran does not make a move tonight, then much like what somebody suggested earlier, will Israel potentially do some kind of a false flag in order to make it look like Iran did something to justify <laughs> it? That is a possibility, all right? For our favorite CENTCOM Commander General Michael Carilla, 7,000. No, no, that fucking docs and generals now! Stop, man! Stop with the doxing, man! Cut the shit! Cut the shit! Fucking docs and generals now? Are you fucking serious? Are you fucking serious? All right, folks, look, I don't know how much longer I can do this show, man. This is getting way out of hand here. All right? This is getting way out of hand. Anyway, once again, Iran does not want a regional escalation. So what are they doing? What are they doing to prevent a regional escalation? They're getting hit up hardcore by Al-Qaeda in Mali. <laughs> Remember that shit? That for a dollar. Five more dollars to the radio graffiti fund. Don't start that shit, please. All right, come on, man. Don't start that shit. I, I, I'm tired of you doing that shit. Y'all make me like some fucking whore or something. Don't do that shit. Jesus Christ, man. I'm, dude, I'm going to end the show. All right, because first of all, this has been a doxing fest. And secondly, you all think that I'm going to do Radio Graffiti after you all fuck this whole goddamn show up? This is a fucking real serious show. I'm trying to convey serious ideas, man. And what do I get? What, what fucking thanks do I get? I get nothing, man. But anyway, Shoigu over there in Iran trying to prevent any kind of upheaval. Because once the United States pulls back its support from Ukraine and... The, the fucking Trump allows him to do whatever the hell he wants to do uh, in Europe. I mean, it's going to be a worse situation than it is now. For our favorite tuber Pipkin. Pip oh, no. Fuck you, dude. Fuck you. Don't don't do that anymore. All right. Don't do that shit anymore. Fucking Pipkin Pippa. Dude, don't do that shit. All right. That's enough. I may have to end this fucking show. This is getting dangerous here, all right? All right, this shit's getting fucking out of hand here, and I don't condone this one bit. I absolutely do not condone this. This is fucking ho This is horrible. I mean, this is this is just fuck this fucked up, man. Hey, wait a minute. Five finger prostate punch. Uh, you're going to do radio graffiti if you like it or not. No, you're not going to fucking tell me what to do. Five finger prostate punch, you fucking piece of shit. Jesus Christ, man. Anyway, I'm sorry. We're, we're trying to continue on here. And what Anibis says, also pledge another $5 for the Radio Graffiti Fund. Now dance, monkey, dance. And we got Duke Orabil. Did you see Warren Buffett has a quarter trillion sitting in cash? $1 from Eddie, 324758, spare Radio Graffiti shekels. And Vox Artificial said Duke Orville is the engineer. No, he's fucking not. Shut your fucking mouth. And we got Pokey from 713 EBT for radio graffiti. All right. Look, can I just continue to talk about Russia here, please? All right. Now, while Russia is, you know, kind of, you know, continuously taking, you know, on the teeth, you know, I mean, even though it may be kind of a stalemate or a quagmire. And then you add uncertainty and security at the homeland? 
I'm telling you, this is how this is how black operation works, baby. Eddie three two four seven five eight. I found more shekels for radio graffiti. I want to hear you get intellectually blacked by Mega Max. Great. All right, Jesus Christ. All right, Jesus Christ. Anyway, let's continue here. All right, we're talking about Russia. Uh, by the way, aside from having to worry about what's going on on the war front, this benefits the damn enemies, for Christ's sake. I mean, committing all these acts of violence. I mean, who? what does this prove? What does this do? What does this do for anybody, for Christ's sake? Fat attacking a fat for being fat. All right, look, listen to me. I'm, I'm getting tired of this crap, all right? I am sincerely getting tired of this fucking garbage. All right, I'm going to get out of here. If you fuckers keep talking shit on text-to-speech, I'm not joking! Jesus Christ, you fucking pieces of shit. All right, anyway, uh, the new prime minister, which is, of course, a Labor Party prime minister, has come out and has condemned, quote, the far-right thuggery. So now you've got the Labor Party, instead of focusing on the fact that it may have be, just may be, an immigration policy that has been too abundant on the side of <laughs> certain groups. It's far right thuggery. If they can't even fucking handle these riots, then they ought to send the British Army. If not them, then someone actually competent. If you voted for me, you'd have seen these people already handled long ago and sensibly. I believe you there, Count Benface. I believe you. And I don't think it's real far-right thuggery, per se. I mean, this is a uh, response to policy. Good luck, China. Let's see how that works for you with an already debased currency, you fucking idiot. I'd buy that for a dollar. Death to Death to What the? Oh, uh, uh, yeah, right. Nick Fuentes, by the way. All right, shut your stupid stinking salmon smelling hole, all right? Now, let's move away from China, and let's talk about the things we were discussing in the past couple of shows. Uh, anyway, let's just go ahead. And hold on, hold on just a second. Let me take the fucking Vaughn people out of here. All right? Take the Vaughn people. I don't want... I fucking hate the Vaughn fucking chat. Take, take them out of here. All right? I'm not fucking joking around. Take them out of here. Fucking get that guy out of here. Fucking hate having this stupid fucking goddamn Vaughn chat open. Get them all out of here. All right? Get them all the fuck out. Ban them all. Get out of here. Get the fuck out. Fucking piece of shit. All right, I'm, 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 I fucking can't stand the Vaughn chat, dude. I swear to God, I'm only going to do ghost shows on Vaughn chat because I fucking can't stand the fuck. I can't, I, I just can't stand them, dude. I can't stand the people that hang there. They they suck. They're pathetic. And I, I really don't fucking like it. I'm not, I, I may just stop. I may just stop doing go uh, true capitalist radio and just do go shows only on uh, Vaughn because I, you know what let me let me let me cut the Vaughn chat now all right let's cut the Vaughn hey you know what I'm cutting the Vaughn stream now because I don't like you people all right I don't like you people so hey Vaughn everybody in Vaughn chat fuck you how do you like that everybody in Vaughn chat fuck you all right I'm out of here <laughs> fucking. All right, I've taken off Vaughn. All right, I've taken off Vaughn. I don't want to see these fucking people. Get them out of here. All right, get them the fuck out of here. Piece of shit. Anyway, I'm sorry, folks. I'm just, I'm just sick of, you know, these stupid troll terrorist cyber vermin scumbags that insist on coming to True Capitalist Radio even though I told them to stay the fuck away. Stay the fuck away. Jesus Christ, man. All right. Anyway, you know what? You know, you know what? Fuck this. I'm out of here. All right. Uh, you know, I'm getting the fuck out of here. All right. I, I, have, I have a whole bunch of other shit to talk about, but you people aren't listening. You people are just fucking putting a couple of fingers in your ass, gyrating it counterclockwise, and hope that you, you know, do an anal squirt. All right. That's all you fucking people know how to do. You people make me want to fucking puke. Fucking can't stand you. I'm serious. I'm not fucking. I, I cannot stand you fucks. But you know what? I'm going to do some totally useless news for you pricks. All right. I'm going to do some totally useless news because this pertains to you. All right. And I'm sure many of you can attest to this. It really does hurt to think. Oh, dude, 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 10 bucks, Vox. I'm not fucking doing radio graffiti for fucking 10 bucks, dude. All right. Give me a fucking break. All right. You can't even buy McDonald's for fucking 10 bucks, you piece of shit. 
Jesus fucking here. Here's ten. Yeah, here you gotta get it to right at your feet. You, I, you can't even fucking buy fucking McDonald's with ten bucks. Fucking moron. Anyway, as I was stating, it really does hurt to think. Huh? It really does hurt to think. And I'm sure that's why many of you idiots don't think at all. Many of you idiots don't think at all. Oh, oh. And what is this? Pace bon and and radio graffiti play. No, fuck you, man. Fuck you. Don't tell me what the fuck to do on my own fucking show, you fucking piece of shit. All right? And like a troll in the interwebs with another 10. It'll still get you a beer, maybe a radio graffiti. Oh, Jesus Christ. Look at it. Everybody's fucking donating 10 bucks now. Uh, like I'm a $10 whore, for fuck's sake. I'm supposed to give these fuckers like a lap dance or something. Uh, am I supposed to fucking lap dance you to fucking, you know, I'm carrying away, you know, like that shit? <sighs> All right, folks. Look, I'm, I'm sorry. You know, I, I'm just trying to do a show here is all I'm trying to do. I'm just trying to do a fucking show. Anyway, it hurts to think. I'm sure this applies to most of you losers. All right, I'm sure it applies to most of you morons. All right, who else do we have? What, what other fucking totally useless news do I have? Oh, yeah, another thing. Another thing that has uh, me here. Oh, you fucks. You fucks. All right, Alexander the Resurrection, go fuck yourself. Stick a, take a snake ass up your ass. And Five Finger Prostate Punch with a $20 bill. I'll throw in a Radio Graffiti. There's Eddie. Two dollars. I get a drink there. You get a graffiti. Well, you know what? This totally useless news probably applies to most of you. All right, take a look at this. Put the PC shot on. France is selling scratch and sniff baguette stamps. Can you believe this? They're selling scratch and sniff baguette stamps. So there you fucking go. Huh? There you fucking go. And by the way, the local bakers are like, Oh, it tastes like, it smells like a vanilla. It don't smell like a baguette. It smells like a vanilla, and I don't like it. So they don't like it. Uh, but uh, apparently the postage stamp is because of the baguette lifestyle, and it is a French symbol, apparently, and these are going to be in limited uh, production. I mean, how many of them are going to be distributed If you, in case you want them? Uh, they're $2.14 a stamp, and there's going to be 594,000 baguette scratch-and-sniff stamps for your buying pleasure. Okay? So there you go. Totally useless news. All right, let's do one more totally useless news. All right? One more. And hold on, uh, Tesla Cyberheart, uh, thanks for the TCR tramp stamp daddy. Don't call me your fucking daddy, dude, all right? Don't call me your daddy. Anyway, look, this is something I think everybody should take a look at, all right? Hidden numbers, optical illusion goes viral, all right? Now, what do you see in this picture right here? All right, I'm asking everyone, what does everybody see in that picture? Because apparently people see different things. Some people see numbers. Some people see the word kill, believe it or not. I don't know where you can see that. All right. All right. I, 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 no bad man sees something. Uh, yeah, that's what I see. Four, five, two, eight, three. That's certainly what I see. Somebody sees an eight. I kind of see a three right here. There's a three. There's a four. There's a five. There's a two. There's an eight. There's a three. All right, and hold on. Five finger prostate punch. How much more to get radiography? Dude, come on, man. Sit. This is sissy hypno. Fuck you, asshole. This is sissy hypno. Go fuck yourself. You see, this is why I don't want to do radio fucking graffiti. You see this shit? I'm doing sissy hypno. Fuck you, dude. Jesus Christ. You know what? I, you know. Figure out. I buy figure that it out. For a dollar. They made another anime version of the Trump assassin. Yeah, like, I really want to see that no coke tan. Like, I really want to see that shit. Anyway, look, I'm going to go ahead and smoke uh, some tobacco, all right? And Vox Art Officials, Ghost is turning his fans trans. 
You see instructions. Dude, uh, shut up. You see instructions. Yeah, like you're being fucking... Like you're, you're being activated. By the way, uh, ch check out the fucking merch. Uh, I got an activation shirt up there, believe it or not. You can hypnotize people while wearing the shirt. I'm not even fucking joking around. Take a look at the merch, if you will. All right? We got a fucking activation shirt there. Anyway, uh, I think everybody kind of sees the numbers. Uh, you know, did you see like a three, four, five, two, eight, three there? There's another nine I can barely see at the end of the at the end of it there. I don't see where anybody. I mean, there's some people that actually see the word "kill." I, I don't see it. I absolutely don't see it. But I do see the numbers three, four, five, two, eight, three, and nine at the end. All right. So anyway, uh, let me go ahead and take a smoke of this. Uh, Tobacco. We're not, you know, smoking any illegal contraband here. And uh, I want to say cheers to everybody out there who is listening to me on a carpet munch in Monday. Uh, cheers to each and every one of you, man. All right, let me go ahead and take a smoke here. That's it. Gotta hold it in, let it hit the brain, all right? Gotta hold it in, let it hit the brain. It says ghost is a psyop. Fuck you, you piece of shit. All right. <laughs> it I says ghost is a psyop. That's someone's phone number, ghost. What the fuck? Fuck you, J7. It's nobody's fucking phone number, you asshole. All right. I get it that you go into men's shit stalls looking for, hey, for a good time, call John. I get it, dude, but it, that ain't it. All right. Anyway, I think everybody agrees that, you know, it's, 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 it's a set of numbers. All right. Uh, put the PC shot on. Uh, we've got... Uh, We've got Noko Tan, who said they've made another anime version of the Trump assassination attempt. Well, let's take a look. All right, what is this? What is this? Oh, Jesus Christ, man. These fucking goddamn anime, man. I can't stand anime! I can't stand the people who like it either. You're fucking weirdos, dude. And look at Duke Orville doing the math on that number that was in that uh, little mind puzzle there. Duke Orville with a five dollar rumble rant said three four five two eight three nine is or is a prime number. Ooh man, I almost feel like that we're in the movie Pie there for a second. Huh? Cheers to Duke Orville, man. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at this ridiculous anime representation of the Trump assassination. Good God. And uh, trolling the interwebs, Ghost, you got to get a fridge magnet and the merch. No shit, I got to take a look at that. Cheers to trolling the interwebs. I'd buy that for a dollar. And Froppy said, I think it, that was the number for radio graffiti. All right, we're going to have radio fucking graffiti. Just calm down. Calm your ass down. Hey, we're going to play this. What is this? <laughs> what is this? What is this crap? Are you kidding me? Fucking anime freaks, man. Fucking anime freaks. You anime freaks, man. You anime freaks. God, take this shit out of here. Take this shit out of here. All right, I'm sorry we even had to see that because of Noko Tan. All right, Jesus fucking Christ, man. All right, let's 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 move on. All right, I look. I, I know I skipped ahead and I went to totally useless news. I do want to talk about a couple of things before I before we go to radio graffiti or whatever we're gonna do here. Uh, one thing I wanted to do was talk a little bit about uh, Maduro over there in Venezuela. Anyway, with that being said, I guess we'll get to Radio Graffiti. I do have to end streams, though, on uh, YouTube and on the X uh, stream. So I do want to say cheers to the folks in YouTube and X. And before I go uh, over there, I'd like to remind everybody uh, to join the True Capitalist Radio membership. All right, take a look at this. True Capitalist Basic Membership or the True Capitalist Membership Higher Tier. Uh, dude, we have, I'm, I'm there almost every day during the week. All right, we have serious conversations about serious subject matters, the stock market, finance, uh, politics, international relations. So anybody who appreciates you know that kind of serious conversation, 
without any kind of internet drama, without any kind of trolling, without any of that shit, uh, go hook it up. I will be in this chat room uh, 30 minutes after I end this show. All right? And that's after Radio Graffiti. I'm going to end it, unfortunately, for X and YouTube. But uh, after I end Radio Graffiti, I will be in the chat room. And by the way, we've got like 52 members now in the True Capitalist Radio Show membership. And uh, I want to say cheers to each and every one of you. Now, I do have an announcement. I am going to give away something to each and every member. I don't want to say what it is. All right. I But it's going to be probably given away. I hope by the end of the month, but early next month, because I have to get it produced. You know, I've got to send it and, and get it produced. So it's it's going to be a, it's going to be it's going to be something cool, and it's going to be something collectible as well. I'm not even fucking joking around. And I'll be giving something. Once I give it away, I'll be giving one to a member every month. I'm going to give a new whatever I'm going to give away every month to a member. I'm not even fucking kidding. So cheers to the True Capitalist Radio membership chat. All right. I'll be in that chat room 30 minutes after I end this show. Okay, so everybody over there on YouTube, everybody over there on X, thank you very much for tuning in with me. Uh, I don't know when I'm going to be back for another True Capitalist Radio. I may do one tomorrow. If not, I may do a ghost show on Wednesday. And if I do a ghost show on Wednesday, I'm obviously going to be... Or I might do... I don't know what. I don't know what I'm going to do. But follow me on X or Twitter. To find out, it's probably the fastest way to find out when I'm going to do these things. The Ghost Report, all one word, no underscores. Let me go ahead and show everybody that happens to be listening. All right. Put the PC shot on right here. The Ghost Report, all one word, no underscores. Follow me on there, and you'll be the first notified to whenever I do what whatever fucking show. I'm doing more shows more often, so everybody can chill, but... Uh, Follow me on X or Twitter, all right? So, YouTube X, cheers to you folks. Thank you for tuning in with me. And until next time, I'm out of here. <laughs> Woo!